It's time to visit Hudson Gate in PlayStation Home, which is like Stargate, except with Bomberman. Lots of people dressed in bikinis and dolphins. From Hudson Entertainment, there's Hudson Gate. But it's more than just a shameless way to advertise, and by shameless I mean really clever. I love how they advertise in PlayStation Home, it's really cool. Very innovative. And Hudson does a nice job with that, in fact I actually know what games they've got coming out, thanks to visiting Hudson Gate. But is there anything more than just advertising there? Well, for one thing it looks really badass. Whoever designed this place deserves a pat on the back and a dolphin sandwich, because it's pretty cool. You can have the same kind of deep intellectual conversations with your friends that you have in any PlayStation Home environment, or watch the inane babble of strangers. Now, in addition to being able to buy Hudson published games for your PSP, PS3, and some of the original PS1 games for your PS3, the big thing in here seems to be Dolphy races. Which sounds like gambling to me! Hooray! I have 5,000 virtual imaginary dollars riding on the Dolphy with the devil horns. Yeah, they need to open this up for real gambling. Hudson, come on. You know that is just straight profit. So clearly what I need to do is raise my own Dolphy and make it the best Dolphy ever with flamethrowers, armor plating, machine guns. So here we are, I invited my buddy Raz Kaz in, and uh, it's time to raise a dolphin. I also picked up a golden dolphin because it's really pimp. And along with the PlayStation Boombox, which plays imitation Beastie Boys and does work in the Dolphy room, it's time to genetically engineer a Dolphy. Meet Wind Squid. He looks a bit hungry, let's feed him, and then start him off on a rigorous training regimen to make him a champion. Incidentally, check out the beats from the playground boombox. Dolphins like music. It doesn't seem like you can do much with them at first, so if this is anything like Hudson's own My Aquarium, I'll have to check back in a day or two and see if the Dig Dugs helped out at all. Because once Wind Squid grows, he's ready to be customized and compete in some races and cheat. If he masters Dig Dug like I'm training him, he should be able to explode other dolphins by shoving a bike pump into their blowhole. <laughs> 